Welcome to Be Here. I'm your host and travel agent Chris Marks and welcome to Highlands, North Carolina. On this episode, we'll check out what the town of Highlands, North Carolina has to offer, including various restaurants, hiking up Whiteside Mountain, meeting some friendly four-legged locals, and experiencing the beautiful view from Sunset Rock. Highlands is a small town in Macon County of North Carolina, located in the Southern Appalachian Mountains. It may be a small town, but it has no shortage of charm and hospitality. The town's elevation is 4,118 feet above sea level, and when you visit the downtown strip, you'll find all kinds of shops and restaurants as well as hotels to suit your every need. You could spend an entire day on the strip and still find the desire to return the following day. Let's see what this place has to eat. One of the restaurants we're gonna check out here in Highlands, North Carolina is The Ugly Dog. Hopefully it's not too ugly because I'm hungry. The Ugly Dog is a cozy classic tavern with a wide variety of delicious menu options. And you can also eat outside to enjoy the beautiful mountain weather. I got a mushroom burger with some bacon and fries. Baby, what do we got over here? I got a portobello a burger. So it's vegan or vegetarian, I guess. And you got some blue cheese coleslaw over here. Mm-hmm. Sherry, what do you got? I got a chili cheese dog and really great coleslaw with blue cheese in it. And my dad, you couldn't get a bigger sandwich, could you? Pulled pork, coleslaw, and tater tots. This is gonna be an amazing meal. We're gonna enjoy it and be here. On our way back to the cabins, we discovered we weren't the only ones who were hungry. An impressive black bear had broken into a bird feeder to snack on the seeds. You never know what you'll see on B here. There's a bear in the front yard. We watched the bear from the front porch and tried to keep a safe distance. Eventually the bear ran away after hearing a dog barking. I had never been this close to a wild bear before in my life. After the bear had left, we decided to go on our first hike. A hike up Whiteside Mountain. We just arrived at one of the key hiking spots in Highlands, North Carolina, Whiteside Mountain. Let's go check it out. There is a small fee for parking, but it's well worth it. And of course, we had to continue this love-hate relationship. Ah yes, our old rival, stairs. Thankfully, there's a straight path that leads you to the top of the mountain. So this is the way up to Whiteside. Going up the hill, it's not the best view in the world. However, once you get up there, it is amazing and is well worth it. It's not that difficult, it's just a steady incline. So be prepared for that. Oh, that's nice. The heavens are shining upon us. And the heavens did indeed open up to give us one of the most spectacular views we've ever seen on a hike. At certain points along this hike, the trail can be a little tight with all the bushes, but that's okay. You just suck it in, man! Whiteside Mountain is between Highlands and Cashiers, as well as the Georgia border. Whiteside also has the highest cliffs in all of Eastern North America. One of the great things about Whiteside is that literally more than half the hike is just view after view after view after view, and they're all good. Some are better than others, but right here, this is one of the better ones. Just soak all that in. And this right over here, all the rock that you see on the side, that is why the mountain is called Whiteside. If we were looking from the ground area, you'd see that this entire side of the mountain is mostly just rock. Fortunately, at pretty much all the spots, you have these fenced off areas to keep people safe. So you got no worries about falling. Indeed, Whiteside has no shortage of beautiful views to enjoy. And if you're lucky, you may even witness falcons and eagles soaring through the skies right next to the cliffs. Birds gonna fly, but humans gotta walk. And walk we do to more and more impressive sights and views throughout the mountain. If you ever get the good fortune to go on this hike, do yourself a favor and take your sweet time to soak in all the glory that is Whiteside Mountain. 
So this little rock right here, I believe, is the highest point of Whiteside, 4,930 feet. And this, like I said, there's plenty of views, but this is definitely one of the better ones. So when you come to Whiteside, you gotta check it out, stand on this rock, get a nice picture, make a nice memory, and remember to be here. And once we got off the hike, we had to go visit some of the friendly locals. Even the horses are nice in Highlands. Go figure. Hey, buddy. You want to have some of that? There we go. He doesn't bite. He moves the lips. Yeah. Only. It's so cute. He's a nibbler. Whether it's hiking or horses, be here. Now let's check out one of the most beautiful ways to end the day in Highlands. We're about to go check out Sunset Rock. It's a beautiful view that we'll be able to look at downtown Highlands and get a beautiful sunset all at the same time. It's gonna be really cool. So romantic. So romantic. So romantic. <laughs> oh, darling. Oh, no. oh, make me barf. We have just reached the top. We're about to check out the beautiful sunset on Sunset Rock. Reaching the end of this hike was like stepping through a portal of light. And then we reached the beautiful magnificence that is Sunset Rock. What a lovely view it is. This is Sunset Rock. There's a lot of ridges on here, so make sure you bring something comfortable to sit on. This is the beautiful view from Sunset Rock. We can see all the trees down there. You can actually see downtown Highlands right there in the shot. That's a beautiful view of all that, but we're all here for this. What's crazy to me is that the sun just set over there, and yet the sun is still reflecting off of that big cloud up there, and it is giving us almost daylight level of brightness. Crazy how the sun works. Sunset Rock, check it out, and remember to be here. And after the sunset, we decided to once again visit downtown Highlands. We're gonna check out the nightlife in downtown Highlands. It's a little small of a town, but you know, still some good stuff. I think we're gonna satisfy our sweet tooth in a minute here. Let's find out. Sweet tooth indeed. We're about to enter the most dangerous store in the entire town. The dessert store. Dun, 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 dun. Mm. Is that right? Sooner or later, there will be the technology to where you can smell what is on TV. This should be one of those days. There is no shortage of tasty treats to satisfy anyone's sweet tooth craving in this place. I want everything! And if you come here, you gotta try Kilwin's delicious ice cream. In case you're wondering, we did indeed get something from Kilwin's. We got two scoops of chocolate fudge brownie ice cream in a waffle bowl. Oh yeah. I'll share it again. Oh yeah. And when you visit Highlands, whether it's visiting downtown, dining at a restaurant, or going on a gorgeous hike, always remember to be here.